it's Amy. Welcome to Thursday. So what do you think will happen? What's the worst case scenario that could happen if you let go of control and decided to loosen your gra your grit, your grasp? I got it out. I know that a lot of people I'm talking to lately are telling me that this is one of their biggest issues is learning how to let go of control and trust and surrender and operate from that place instead of a place of a tight grasp, needing to do everything your way, needing to have a specific outcome. And what that is rooted in, and I've talked about this, is fear. Fear of the outcome. What's it going to look like if you don't have a direct say and you're not directly involved? So what this type of action can produce, always needing to be in control, total stress. I'm sure if you are resonating with what I'm talking about right now, you know what I mean. So in order for you to loosen your grasp, you're going to have to practice loosening your grasp. You're going to have to practice trusting and becoming aware that you don't always have to have some sort of say in how things are run how things are done. And you might need to have a look at your expectations of what it has to, what it must look like, the outcome in your relationship, how things are done in your home, in your business, how employees or colleagues do things. So, you know, what's the worst case scenario if you let other people contribute more? I know some of the best case benefits is that you're gonna have more freedom. You are gonna have more time for yourself. Can you imagine being able to do the things that you love again? Not just maybe once a month or once every two months, but on a consistent basis? You're going to feel like so much of the world has been taken off your shoulders and your responsibilities won't seem so heavy because you won't always have to be the one to take care of everything. And that is a personal choice. So today, choose to consciously surrender and believe that things will be okay. You'll need to have a look at some beliefs that may have been holding you back so that you feel like you have to have everything under your control. So lots of love to you. I want to encourage you to hop on my next webinar next Wednesday. I believe it's March 23rd. Have to have a look on your calendar next Wednesday, 11 a.m. It's a free webinar and I'm going to be training on exactly this. Why it's so important that you let go, that you learn to let go and surrender so that you can have your time back, you can have your mental space back and other people will begin to relax as well because you'll start to trust other people more. Okay, hope you can make it. I'll share the link below and do let me know, like, what do you think? What has helped you relax and let your tight grasp loosen? I'd love to hear. Okay, bye.